in this video we are going to discuss about metrics roles and responsibilities in service desk what are the metrics in service desk the metrics which we consider in service desk are average call resolution or average call duration so what is the average call which we receive and what is the duration of the call uh, what we resolve here percentage of calls picked up in three rings or percentage of unattended calls so what is the percentage of calls which we receive and also what is the unattended calls after the three rings accuracy of updating the ticket status of sla breaches so what is the accuracy of the ticket status of sla breaches in the sense if sla got breached that means the resolution sla and the response sla got breached what is the accuracy of updating the tickets also is considered in the service desk function timely escalations so what are the timely escalations which service desk has done also is considered in the metrics of service desk customer satisfaction how many d sats and how many c sats you got in the customer satisfaction survey is also considered so what are the key roles and what are the roles responsibilities in service desk the key roles in service desk are of the service desk staff and service desk manager and what is the responsibility of service desk staff to perform all the activities of service desk as applicable as designed by the service desk manager what are all the activities to be performed by service desk should be performed by the service desk staff coming to service desk manager he is required to oversee the functioning of service desk so he is the person who will be overseeing the service desk functions as well as their activities and if any modifications are there he is the person who will be responsible to oversee or update them to build service desk team for new services if a new service or a new software which which is used by the users comes into service desk support he is the first person to build service desk team for new services and update them in the timely manner to monitor the performance of service desk on regular basis so he is the person who will be monitoring the performance of service desk on the regular basis to identify and work on the continual improvement of service desk so he will be identifying the new services or any flaws in the service desk activities and he will be updating them by that he is doing the continual improvement of the service desk by these roles and responsibilities this manager is responsible for the service desk functioning 